you come up against legal and practical issues every day. QuickCall gives you direct access to our team of specialist education advisors. Your queries will be resolved quickly and with certainty of cost. There's always been a general perception that you do have to do this, and particularly for head teacher roles, that you have to advertise them on a national basis. Well, actually, that's not the requirement anymore. That was abolished in 2009. So, is it still best practice? Well, the guidance says that you should do so unless you've got good reason not to. That's quite broad and good reason isn't defined. One example of a good reason might be if you've got an internal candidate who you think is right for the job, you've benchmarked them and you think they'd be good. The risk with doing it that way is firstly on a practical level that you might get other people grumbling in the staff room, but the legal risk is whether or not somebody could claim that, that they are being discriminated against. This might be that because of their sex or their race or their disability that you are not giving them the opportunity to apply for the role. If you thought about that and there isn't anyone who falls into that category, then you might decide not to advertise externally or nationally and save yourself some time and some money with the advert.